Welcome back to the Digital Infinity. Today we're going to be going over a BBS store game I came across called Dust to Dust, the God Machine. It says here, would you like to enter in Dust to Dust or L to leave like the Lord Addict Yar, Legend of the Red Dragon, everybody played it, every BBS had it back in the day. It was an amazing game. Looks like this game keeps warning you need your num lock on. Uh, let's see, starting out here, I got 10,000, find some land, build a suburb, start making money, build some farms to feed those people, build electric plants to power all the, all the toasters, uh, join the commonwealth to bring down your cost. Here's what land looks like, identify, okay. On this day, happy breakdown yesterday, 100%. Security relax, they're groovy, people are enjoying their toasted bread, uh, people have enough to eat, your food stores are peachy, overall happy rating 100%. Prognosis page, Timmy's health, okay, Timmy's story. Dr. Nyingal was a scientist who devoted his entire life to healing the sick, saving lives and, and surfing. Until one day his son, little Timmy, caught RLT disease, commonly known as rare life-threatening disease. The doctor was devastated and devoted his life to finding the cure. It took two weeks. <laughs> okay, he created a compound of goo, ick, gunk, and the legendary yuck, which until now had only been theorized about. The resulting product was splooge, an extremely sticky purple gloop, but that wasn't the cure. The cure was a byproduct of splooge, and, and he found that every ton of splooge created, one gram of cure was also created. He turned to the governments of the world to help him produce enough splooge to save his son. Will you help poor little Timmy? Poor little Timmy, creating splooge also creates a byproduct for the cure of the disease, inflicting Timmy. Cure Timmy, and everyone on the planet gets a nice surprise. Okay. The doctor, obviously extremely intelligent. Uh, he is devastated that his son got sick and in two weeks came up with the cure. Uh, no one ever else did this before, so all right. To win the game, you must achieve 250 game points and finish all 40 missions. Okay, let's get started here. Um... Yeah, I need to claim some land, and then build on the claim land. Okay, um, let's claim some land by clicking C. Uh-oh, Green Godana land fighters have entered our atmosphere. I have claimed this land for Land of the Freak. Okay, let's build a suburb on your land. Click B, and then C. More buildings, S for suburb. Oh no, Green Godana land, the evil invader from outer space has begun to raid some poor defenseless gold mines and mineral deposits. If there was a ruler that could swoop down and carry these riches away before, okay. Curse Green Dona Land, this is the last time that we'll raid my planet. Get my plane ready for takeoff. I will crush Green Dona Land, okay. Instructions. Aim. Collect the unrefined gold in your ship before the evil Green Dona Land raiding party gets them or kills you. Use numeric keypad to move about. Make sure numlock is on. Hint. Hold the key down to, for greater movement. Okay, I'm pressing on the number pad. Okay, I'm the blue guy. Okay, oh, got most of the gold there, and uh, I guess I didn't quite get it all. Um, oh, and I think I've been shot down. Okay. Um, Green Dona Land, you will pay for your this insult. This I shall build an empire who shall... <laughs> okay. Um, you're pledging your devotion to destroy these guys. Okay. Looks like we're back at it. Um, it's kind of cool here that it's like building a graphical map there on the right. I've never seen a BBS door game like this one. This thing's pretty intense. Um, okay, we're going to build a farm. And, I, oh, I think I built a farm over my suburb that I was developing. Mm, that might not have been a good idea. Uh, okay, I'm going to move over to the left now. Okay, I've got another section map. I'm going to claim this for me. 
and I'm pretty much out. I'm too tired to move. I'm out of moves now. So I've never really played a BBS door game like this, Dust to Dust, where it had so much interactivity with what's going on on the screen. Actually moving a cursor-style object around, collecting things on the screen, um, moving a character on the map, claiming land. Um, it's a little bit like a strategy game and a little bit like uh, collect, uh, collect the hidden object. I never really played anything else like this before. Let me know if anybody else out there has played anything similar to this or this game and got any further than just a day's worth of work. I hope you enjoyed this and thanks for watching. Thanks for stopping by the Digital Infinity. Please like, comment, and subscribe below. And as always, thanks for watching. Digital Infinity, out.